match milestone is underway here. Team 868, the Tech Hounds, will successfully score a cone to start it off before getting onto the station. 49-26, Galactic, with an impressive auto-balancing autonomous system, will also do the same, giving the Red Alliance a slight edge, though the Blue Alliance will have the lead 34-27. With all robots in full motion around the field, 69-56, will attempt to grab a cone. They get denied by 461 in a temporary defensive move before they run across the field in order to cycle impressively quick, taking signals from Galactech's human player. 9071 Slicer Tech slowly crawling across the field, attempting to grab a cone by the driver's station. Let's hope they get it going. Over on the red side of the field, they have already completed one successful link in front of the West Side Boiler Invasion driver station. They've completed two, as a matter of fact. We'll see if they'll be the first to get that highly coveted ranking point. Back on the blue side of the alliance, the Pike Robo Devils, with a, some devil horns and an impressive LED system, will grab cone, a cube placed on the floor by their human player instead of the traditional sliding, sliding down. 461, again in a temporary defensive motion. It does not last long. They make the contact before going to score unshaken. 868, the Tech Hounds once again sliding across the field with their swerve system, dodging red defenders before getting back to their loading station. 6956 remains in midfield. We're approaching endgame, and it's currently 63-61. The endgame will be the primary decider. Shamrock Botics, as a matter of fact, has finally has scored early. Back on the Red Alliance, all three robots in the community, but let's see if they all climb. It's three full-sized robots, and that's proven to be very difficult to accommodate in this event. With 12 seconds left, the Blue Alliance Pike gets stuck temporarily. They do get up. We'll see if Shamrock joins them. With a few left, it's five, four, three, two, one. That will be the match with successful double engages on both sides. The end game could very well be the decider here. Let's see how it shakes out. Lights are green, please correct, collect your robots and we have a final score. It's the Red Alliance winning 98 to 85. The only really differential between the two teams was the grid.